welcome to nv commerce academy in the last lecture we have completed the third method of measuring price elasticity of demand now we will move to the next method and name of method is arc method arc method of measuring price elasticity of demand is dependent on average responsiveness to the price change so before starting this method first we will have to understand what is the meaning of arc so first of all we will draw out a demand curve at p price quantity demanded is q and if price falls then demand extends to q1 so this is our demand curve dd and this portion shown by these two points a and c this is arc so what an arc is arc is portion between two points on a demand curve so elasticity obtained when midpoint or average price and quantity are used is known as arc elasticity method of measuring price elasticity of demand if we come to formula for measuring price elasticity it would be q1 minus q divided by q1 plus q multiplied by p1 plus p divided by p1 minus p so for derivation we will start with formula of measuring price elasticity of demand according to percentage method it was p upon q into delta q upon delta p in this formula delta q and delta p both concepts are same because we have to calculate difference or change in price or change in quantity that would be depicted by delta q and delta p but if we come to take initial price or initial quantity then we have to take average of the prices so isme hame kya change karna hai instead of initial price or initial quantity we will take average price or average quantity so our formula would be change in quantity divided by half of sum of quantities divided by change in price upon half of sum of prices so if we write it in symbolic form change in quantity that would be delta q half of sum of quantity half of q1 plus q divided by change in price delta p and half of p1 plus p so delta q half of q1 plus q half of p1 plus p divided by delta p half half cancel and delta q ko agar main elaborate form mein likhu that would be q1 minus q divided by q1 plus q multiplied p1 plus p divided by p1 minus p so for measuring price elasticity of demand according to arc elasticity method that would be the formula the single change between arc method and percentage method is price in point method we had to calculate elasticity of demand on a particular point so initial price and quantity we used but in arc there are various prices in this region so for this we have to take average of prices as well as quantities